Hello, and we are doing a tutorial on Scorpion Normal Mode. Um, she's got a daily quest that you can do uh, for her cosmetics, I believe. We'll find out when we get there. I'm pretty sure I'm right. Not always right. I am human. But here we go. We are going to travel. Sand Sea, then Bastion. By the way, this is the in-game boss. Um, so once you've completed the storyline, she's part of it. Uh, you'll have her unlocked and you will have the raid unlocked once your item levels are 751 uh, or your ear score, whichever you want to call it. Your average power is what they call it in-game. I'm just, I'm used to calling it item level. Um, anywho, you got a skiff master. Travel to the Valley of Undying King. And if you have watched the other tutorials on the pyramids that I've done, like Krakos and Garfeld, you can go in here to this portal room, travel straight there. But this for the purpose of not having that, you run straight to this giant pyramid. It's a good little run. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. I'm gonna get stuck on a rock. Uh, let me help this guy real quick, guys. I'm so he's just about to die. Ah, I tried to help him. Sorry, buddy. I almost had you. Anywho, it's all about community, helping each other. See, that only took about 10 seconds. Even though he died, we almost had it. But this is the Great Pyramid. Do, do, do. See, it's a big boy. Oh, I'm glad there's no fall damage in this game. You just go straight back northwest of the map, and boom, you're at the Great Pyramid. So if you go to this option, will uh, send you into Dijin's challenge. Um, and then if you go here, this is where Scorpion's at, the Keeper of Death's Burial Chamber. Or you can go back to Sect Temple. I don't like saying his regular name because it sounds like something else. And if uh, YouTube decides to translate that, it's going to look weird. So we're not going to pronounce the S. I'm just going to say Sect and anyways, let's enter the Keeper of Death's Burial Chamber. And this is soloable. You can do that. Um, I do it with Berserker, which is a little challenging, but I like a challenge. These guys are all probably waiting to raid. This is also how you get to the raid. So you just enter here. Um, the Keeper of Death's Sanctuary. It's normal mode. And you get Scorpion Crystal Dust. The raid mode is the Temple of Death, and you can queue publicly or private if you have your own group. Um, obviously, if you have your own group, it's going to run a lot better. Those public queues are very messy. They aggravate me pretty, <laughs> pretty consistently, but usually get it done. Um, and that's for the Sun, the Sun Fury Scythe quest is the uh, public or not public queue? Excuse me for the. Um, challenge but this tutorial we're going to do the normal and you can do this solo like I said we're going to go private and I'll show you the gear you can get from that and basically you start you spawn here whenever you're ready go on out and I am not ready I need potions you got potions equipped Don't forget your potions, Mr. Chestnut. I need to buy some. I am out. Blow through them. 
crazy being a berserker. Oh, of course. How full is he? 90 out of 90. We're going to get rid of that in here. Don't need that. Ooh, the Krakos challenge. Badge unlocked. I thought I already did that. Probably did. Okie dokie. Just gonna trash this stuff. My inventory was also full. Say that again, buddy. My inventory was also full. Yeah. I, I, I stopped. It fills up so quick. It's just like, I can't yeah. get rid of enough of it. I'm gonna use a little food buff, why not? Um, let's. Should be good. I got enough room for potions now. Hi. Right. Oh, what are you doing? Lagging or what? There we go. Go ahead and buy about three stacks of these, cause, and I eat through them. But I also play a lot, so. All right. We'll go ahead and equip those, and we will be on our way. Because you are going to be using the crap out of potions. Especially if you're going solo. Um, I'm going to use Rend. <clears throat> you can use Lucky Shot. It does help. But I like Rend just because the debuff. You just run up here to Scorpion herself. Pretty girl that she is, even though she's mean. And the battle begins. So these crystals, you see how they're red? This is part of the quest as well. All you gotta do is target them, smack it and run away, or it's gonna damage you and stun you. Ooh. And for the daily or repeatable quest, uh, you just have to kill 20 of those. So there's, um, I believe three, yeah, there's three phases in normal mode. I've got to quit scratching my face when we're playing. Every time I do, I get attacked. Um, uh, there's three phases. And <clears throat> the first one's pretty simple. You just gear up and don't die. And this is where I like to kill the crystals. So if you want to um, help me do that, Chestnut. Yeah. See how it stuns you and it hurts? That's bad, especially when she starts um, her other phases. But typically, this is where I like to blow up the crystals because this is her easiest phase. You'll eventually have to blow them up anyways. I can't tell. Um, and I'll explain that here in a minute when the time comes. If you do ever get so low health, and you, get, I usually run a Holy Bolt when I'm solo in here. As a Berserker, just so I get a little extra heal. Um, you know what, I actually might just switch to that, just because. Uh, it also does help to target things. Don't get her down too far yet. We got eight more crystals. I just like to get those out of the way on this spec. That one's about to blow. Get it though. And I'm stuck and stunned. Okay. That one will not, I cannot target that. I don't know. Maybe that's just one. All right, a couple more and we're ready. Whee! That's good enough now because we'll have to blow up some crystals here in a second and that's gonna hurt. Got that over just in time. 
So long. Yeah, that's fine. Just run around to you. Um, I'm gonna let you heal up though for this, because remember, save your ultimate. Uh, guys, you want to save your ultimate for this phase, and I'll tell you why in a second. You want to save your ultimate and your cross skill. Because here in a minute, you're going to want to be able to burn her down. Are your uh, cooldowns good, Chest? Yeah. Okay. So, hold on a second, because I'm going to have to heal. Go ahead and get healed up. Because I want to show them how to do a perfect run, what they consider a perfect okay. run. So just run around until you can heal up all the way. Or get pretty close to it. And she's pretty easy to kite. Uh, for the most part. You gotta do a lot of running. She yeah. can hit you from a range. See, she's almost down. Like, as soon as we're ready, she'll burn. I'm just gonna pop this potion. This is why I like to use Holy Bolt, too. Alright, I'm ready when you are. Yeah, we're good enough. Okay, so we're gonna bite her in the middle here. And once she turns blue she's gonna teleport okay and you need to be looking to go where she's at she's to the left right here right here you gotta get there as quick as you can there's gonna be a crystal behind her see i'm targeting it now you want to burn that pop your cooldown stay out of her stuff i'm gonna kill that as quick as possible and then you kill her before this breaks because it will break the platform we're standing on all right so that's good not travel form, heal up. Okay. She'll teleport back here. And you want to do that every time you can. So pull her here before she teleports. That way you're closest to every point. So see how she spawns scorpions? She gets her minions in the second phase on normal. All you want to do, see their lord toward me, towards me? Boom, you just blow up the diamond with them in it. Come with me, chest. Smack that. Run straight through and they'll boom. See? That's all you do with that. Might have to kite from there for a second. Only because I'm trying to explain this. Ooh, ooh. Oh, I'm dead. Maybe. Nope. I got out of. As long as she doesn't hit me. Hopefully she's aggroed on you. That's all right. It's part of it. The thing is, is you cannot lose this unless the only way to lose is um, by too many minions being spawned on the map. If you need to, you can hang back back here out of combat. Because if you go where my cursor is, you'll like go in and out of combat continuously. So if you need to, you just hang back here. Her health doesn't recover or anything. <clears throat> That's all right. I'll try and pull him off of you. Yeah, I got him. There you are. Um. So on this phase, she's gonna. These crystals are important. Uh, because she's gonna go invincible. And the crystal is the only thing that will break her barrier. And you'll see, it'll announce it on the screen. And whoever has aggro, if you don't know what aggro is, that means her attention. Um, you're going to want to lure her to a crystal, like right here. It was ready to go. Want to lure her, watch that, because that's going to explode on you once it starts blinking. Like that right there, oof, away from them. Get hit by those, you get stunned. She might one shot you. You never know. You're only delaying the inevitable. All right, see, she's no mere mortal can damage me. Bring her right here. Come to me. Go past it. Like, yeah. All right, now you smack it and then run. Boom, see? Knocks her barrier down. As long as she's inside that explosion, knocks her barrier down. Same thing for the raid. Might die there. I gotta take my fingers off. All right, she's getting low, so let's pull her here. Say and um, save your uh, cross skill. Heal up if you need to. Save your ultimate. Let's 
kill these scorpions real quick. Trying to run towards me. We're here. Yeah. Okay. Get rid of those. It helps. We'll just burn her down real quick. Save your cost skill. Woo! Yeah, there. Get ready. She's going to teleport. Okay. She'll either go mid, left, or right. Mid. Right to the top. Pop your cooldowns. The diamond. This is where it gets a little tricky because she got all these menus. She's doing AOE on you too. Oh, don't die. Don't. Oh, not a perfect run. That's okay though. So if we were to um, kill her quick enough right there, the diamond and her, uh, you would get two chests at the end instead of one. Uh, and that's what they call a perfect run. You can do it also on um, the raid, a lot harder on the raid. It's just so unorganized. But this face is basically the same. You just, she looks different and she's got like different attacks that hurt a lot more and are a lot bigger. I hope I heal up. No, 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 get it out of there. But same concept, you're gonna wanna lure her when she's invincible. She hits a lot harder. Do 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 that poison mic. Yeah, I'm gonna throw a holy bolt on her. This is rather hard with the berserker. Too squishy and you hurt yourself. But she's invincible. Um, if you're, you're gonna want to lure her in, close to a crystal, smack it on your way in. It's a little harder to do when she's like this. You want to run past the crystal, smack it and run, she'll follow you. So like, we'll go right here. You have her attention. Is she invincible still? Yeah, she is. All right, that one busted, so get this in here. All right, there we go. Run out. Oop, I got caught by the stun. Hurt, that hurt. No, no. Woo. All right, we're gonna wanna kill some of these monsters too. So run past this way and we'll smack a crystal. Ah. Uh, oh. Holy bolt though. Dang it. All right. As you can see, it's a little bit of a challenge. Not too bad. It's much easier when I can actually focus just on that and not explain it. Plus it's uh, like seven in the morning here, up all night. And these little crystal scorpion quartz are what spawn minions. Kill us too if you need to. But usually I don't have a problem with it. Just pop that right there and then run out. Boom, they're gone. And soon she is, I don't know what percentage, but soon she's, all right. So we're gonna have to lure her. She's on, yeah. woo, I'm stuck. I can click my mouse button, right? But she is once again, I cannot hit them. yeah, it's hard to, it's really hard to target those things. That's the hard part is really just the targeting of the crystal. So I like to like kind of Target it before I go, see she's gonna go to it. Smacked it. Oh no, that one's blown up. Alright, cool. Got out of it. See now she's starting to spawn a lot of AoE. She'll do a real big one here so shortly. It's gonna cover up like most of the map. 
that is not it, that's gonna hurt. Man, this mouse not pushing it hard enough. Tell you what, buddy. There it is. There's the big AOE, and it hurts. See that? There's like four AOEs. Is she invincible? I don't think so. We're getting chased. I'm going to have to kite for a second. Come on, potion. Hurry up. There we go. Yeah, we're, we need to um, clear these guys to so like stay together. All right? Come here. Wait a second. Pop it. I run straight through. There we go. I got rid of most of them. Now we can just almost burn her, probably, unless we get more minions we can handle. Yeah, we might need to clear again. Smack it. There we go. Whoop! I ran right back into it. I mean, it's somewhat of a challenge. It's a fun fight. It really is. I enjoy it. Ah, waited. Whoop! Get out of that. Put her over here towards me. Wait for. All right, now. Watch that. It's a one shot there. Oh, goodness, come on. Come on, give me a holy bolt. I'm a holy bolt. This crystal. Whoop! We about got her. Man, she keeps spawning that AOE. I hate it. You just gotta run away from it. She'll follow you. It's all about learning. Get so many men. Oh, shit, her barrier's up. I didn't even know. Get her through here. Nope, missed her. Get her. Yeah, I think she... No. No? Okay. Yeah, it was down now. All right. Okay, there you are. Yeah, sorry. I had to run for a minute. I was like so low health. All right. Now you just chase her again, and it's over with. She's up here. Um, I think if we can burn her down right here, we might actually get a chest. I think you might have to kill two. She got to do it before she breaks. Oh, we're almost there. Come on, thousand damage, thousand damage. Come on. Oh, we might get two chests. Nope, we only get one. Okay, yeah. So you do have to destroy her every time. But that's okay. Not a perfect run. But that's the mechanics of it, so... You pull her whenever she's on her second phase. You you beat her down on her first phase, uh, and you want to fight her here. And then as soon as she's about to teleport, you just start looking. She's going to spawn not that way, but she's going to spawn either right. Where are we at? Oh, the mid's gone. Sorry. That's what confused me. So the middle would be there, but it broke. Left or right. You just want to be looking. As soon as she's about to teleport, run over there, blow up the diamond. Burn her down uh, in time before the platform breaks um, and do that every time. We'll get two chests here instead of one. Uh, and to break her barrier when she becomes invincible, you smack the crystals. You can also kill the minions that way. It helps. And the only way to lose in normal mode um, is with her... Uh, minions it'll say it across the screen there are too many minions it'll give you a warning and eventually there'd be um, so many that it defaults you it's a default loss so that's basically it for scorpion on normal rates quite a bit different uh, phases and, that, and it's, it's messy because you got 10 people running around that aren't coordinated but you got a good group I would suggest a tank and then a guardian with a taunt, aka provoke. Um, but yeah, you get the dust, which isn't helpful for um, 
like any kind of like, weapons it's for her cosmetics that you get from uh, Lord Sect I believe and once you get done with that you can just run right back here and teleport to let you go back to Lord Sect or anywhere else here we're gonna go back there and turn in our quest and that quest is repeatable for normal you get the scorpion treasure. Um, good experience too. That's the daily though. I go from it. The dust is what you collect uh, for the gear I'm about to show you. So you just destroy 20 crystals, beat her. Decent experience. It's also good for the, um, uh, you can do it in the legendary weapon quest as well. Um, so I will show you what you can get. So this is what the dust is for. Uh, you also got to get the treasures. But you get her cosmetics, or you can buy them, dragon crystals, if you want to. So, oh, <laughs> that's, yeah, I don't know about that on my, uh, character. That's pretty funny looking. Um. Really nice for a female character. Cool set. That that's pretty cool. That'd be a cool set. Something. Yeah, you know, basically that's that's her gear. Let's see what the helm looks. Like. Eh. Okay. Crown. Gloves. And shoulders. Not too much to look at there for me and my preference. But that is how you do the Scorpion Raid. And once you unlock the legendary weapon quest, um, she is part of the daily. Look right here. Beat Scorpion. We just did that. Um, done the Rocco's statue, Garfeld statue. We've done those tutorials already. Uh, but yeah, it's a lot. And you only get one ore, but it is repeatable. So you can grind the uh, Sun Fury Scythe quicker. Just grind the crap out of it. And it's a lot of experience, too. So you got to remember that. You need to infuse your gear. You can do two things at once. You can grind the Sun Fury or by doing this repeatable which is a bunch of dungeons but also doing a bunch of dungeons is going to give you a lot of experience see I'm already almost leveled up we've just been running tutorials you're killing two birds with one stone here or three or four birds accomplishing many things but Sun Fury crafting takes 500 of those bad boys Good luck with that on your journey. We'll do us another little victory dance. Look at Chestnut's form there, a little flying skull. All right. Fist pump it. Jump for joy. Mm-hmm. This is War Scars and my buddy Chestnut. Been on the tutorials with me, helping me out. Keeping me company while I'm uh, sleep deprived and making things a lot funner, chit chatting. Chestnut, if you want to add anything, you can go ahead. Good luck, guys. All right, this is War Scars. I will see you in the next video, hopefully. Follow me, if you will, on Twitch, uh, YouTube, and any other platforms that are uh, going to come in the future. It would be much appreciated, especially Twitch. Um, I'd like to keep putting out content for you guys. Thanks for your support. Thanks for watching. I'm War Scars, and we are out of here.